Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a love reading for uh, the week ahead. So the 24th through the 30th. The 24th through the 30th of November for whoever this resonates with. It's not a private reading. It may not be for you. I don't know who it's for, but for some reason I was called to pick up this deck and do a, a love reading. So this is based on the week of the 24th through the 30th for somebody, not everybody. If it's for you, let me know below. If you could keep the comments short, that'd be great. Because <laughs> I have to approve, I approve the comments. So, you know, you guys, you some of them I just delete if they're really long because I don't have time to read all that shit. So if you could keep the comments short, that would be nice. The temple path. Somebody is going down a new path. Let's follow the yellow brick road. Ooh, action. So I was thinking about this card today in my car. I was. This was the card I was picturing. I mean, this is like... Somebody's taking action in a new direction and going down a new path. And, and when I see this card, it's like opposites. And this is like, this, if you are, this could be, you know, it looks like uh, black chasing white. I mean, I'm going to say what it is. There could be a mixed uh, relationship, you know, and I don't know what you call that, but it doesn't really matter to me. Um, you know, where there's a, I don't know why I'm rubbing that bird. That's funny. I'm trying to get it off of there. <laughs> That's my Virgo rising. I'm sorry. Anyhow, um, this is like the black stallion. Okay. After his, after, after his mare. So. Just beware. Or don't beware. I mean, I don't know. Do you want him to catch you or not? Because he looks like he's right on your tail. We have somebody that is right on another person's tail. Oh, the thinking man. That damn thinking man, he's always coming out, isn't he? He's here. He's he's here. He's he always comes out. And I got a lot. This is a big deck. So he's thinking about what he has to offer. He may be even thinking about moving. I mean, that temple path, he's he's moving home, perhaps. Jeez, some crow. And maybe he's got, got some epiphany during the, the full moon. I mean, we're still feeling it, right? Today is the 23rd. So, yeah. He may have come up with, come, come, I can't speak. It's Mercury retrograde, so please bear with me. Okay, so maybe, you know... This this full moon has awoken something within this man. I don't know. Oh, jeez, some crow. The thinking woman. Yeah, there's soulmates. There's a couple soulmates here. And the moon is right in the middle. Look at this shit. Oh, <laughs> I mean, we have, they're definitely soulmates. And there's something going on behind the scenes that is bringing these two people together. Absolutely. There's something going on behind the scenes that are bringing two soulmates together. Absolutely. And you can't get away. This, you can't get away. It's like there's no place to go. There's no place to run. You can't hide. It's a soulmate connection. Oh, my goodness. The, oh, oh, well, maybe he's got money, too. Wouldn't that be nice? Um... Woman, man holding coin. Well, he's been focused on what he has to offer. We already know that, right?
This man is a very hard worker. He's very established. He's very knowledgeable. Whoever the man is in this dynamic, he he's not poor. He's not poor because he's very, you know, he's a planner. He's absolutely a planner. Um, he doesn't ever come empty-handed. Okay? So whoever is doing the chasing, which is, I believe it's the man, he is definitely not going to come empty-handed. Oh, jeez, I'm crow. I can't even believe this shit. This man is fucking perfect, okay? Oh, jeez, I'm, I'm sorry. I don't know if I'm going to be able to share this one. All right. Okay. He's a thinker. He has a heart. And he's got money. This can't be real. The moon brings deception and lies, so... Just so you know. All right. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to have to think long and hard about this one. Seems really too good to be true. All right. There's no doubt about it. I'm about jumping out of my seat. Son of a bitch. Angel of balance. Okay. Community. <laughs> Let your friends help you. <laughs> okay. Happy family. Happy family. Well, there is an opportunity. There is an opportunity to lead. <laughs> There's an opportunity to have a happily ever after here. There is with happy family. But we have this woman here that is really need going to need to think about if she's if she's ready you know if she's ready to accept anything she may have three opportunities we may have a woman that has three choices you may have if you are the woman that this that portion is for there's there's three men here this could be one man taking on all these qualities um i think they have that in like um well, uh, what, that would be like a fantasy movie of some sort. I don't even know which one. But anyway, um, you know, maybe this woman has been dating. You know, she's been dating. She's been putting herself out there. She's been going out, having fun. Now she's met somebody all of a sudden and, you know, with this full moon. And now there's an opportunity to, you know, <laughs> go down a new path. All right, so it feels as though we have a woman that is being chased. Could be from one man, could be from three. Could be from three men. We have a woman that is absolutely being chased, and she has a tough decision to make, and that's why she's thinking. She's probably reading up about it. You know, what am I going to do? How am I, what am I going to do? You know, doing her own investigation. Anyway, um, it feels as though... <laughs> If you have not met this person yet, you're going to meet him out in the community, you know, outside somewhere. You could even meet this person on a dating app for that matter, because this is dating. And maybe you're just going to start dating this person and you come to find out that this person is everything you ever wished for. An absolute dream come true. Okay. He's, I mean... I'm speechless, put it that way, and that doesn't happen very often. So I think that we have a woman here that has uh, is probably receiving some sort of offer from some man in which she can't run away from because the offer is so effing good. I can't. She not she could probably get away if she she kicked it into gear, but she'll you know, I don't know, when you got the man offering you all this, it's like <laughs> Um, hmm, should I run or should I just play hard to get? So, 
you know, I don't know. Um, yeah. So there's, 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 there's a man that is, that is probably coming into your life or is in your life now that is, he may be thinking about proposing, okay, because he's, you know, he may, he could be even, I mean, he could be getting you a ring and really giving you his heart, like, here it is, here it is, here it is, and this woman is probably going to be like, you know, uh, shit, is this a lie? Is this real? Uh, is this, am I, is this, you know, because is this a fantasy? Because if you think about the moon, the moon is, uh, ruled by, well, I'm not even going to say it, but it's about, it is very, uh, about much about fantasy. Okay. I can't speak cause it's mercury retrograde. So bear with me. It's about escaping reality. So definitely is this a, is this a fairy tale? Is, is it real? So I think that's probably what she's thinking about because this offer seems so too too good to be true. So for some of you that are watching this, it looks as though you are being uh, given an opportunity from a man that seems too good to be true. This person is probably going to rush right into your life and <laughs> knock you off your feet. All right, they they may be coming to help you, or you may meet, you may run into them at some community event. Oh God. Okay, so yeah, I mean, can you give this person your heart? Because there is a soulmate connection here that is taking place, in which. the universe or angels or somebody is bringing two people together at this time because it's meant to be. Hopefully this reading is for you. If you are at home and you're not putting in any effort, then this, this reading is probably not for you. This reading is for people that are ready and want it. Who have told the universe that they're waiting. But then again, the universe works in mysterious ways. Sometimes the universe will bring people into your life when you least expect it. And it changes your path forever. So that could certainly be the case. Either way, there's a soulmate connection here in which somebody is is going after what they want. It doesn't look like she's really trying to get away. <laughs> Maybe she is, but well, I don't know. So yeah, there's an opportunity for happily ever after. I can't cover that up. I cover up this community card. Okay. So yeah, there's an opportunity for a soulmate connection. Okay, that's all I can say. These are soulmates and these are soulmates. A soulmate connection is big time. And this person is gonna help to bring balance. You guys are gonna help each other. It's meant to be the soulmate connection in which action is going to be taken courtesy of the universe. Good luck.